Welcome to Dukes and Me. I'm Matt. And I'm Serge. And today we'll cook some beautiful King Island tomahawk steaks. And with it, you're going to be baking some beautiful potatoes. Going to load them up with heaps of flavour. It's going to be delicious. Yeah, boy! Woo! Ooh, hot potato. We're making some baked potatoes now. Do some meat style. First, we'll need to punch some holes into these babies, like in a prison riot. Just go around. After that, we'll be rubbing them with some olive oil and salt and simply bake them at 180 for about an hour. Alright, so we're cooking these beasts today. They're big, thick, and juicy. Um, we rub them with the Ancho Espresso rub. They've been sitting there for about an hour. Um, it's pretty much now time to chuck them on the barbie and start cooking. Yeah, boy. So the meat's on. Cooking with an indirect heat today. And we want to make sure that we're capturing all these delicious juices that's going to be leaving the meat uh, shortly. So we're using a drip tray. And in there we've packed it with some olive oil, garlic, thyme, and a heap of butter. So I'm basting the meat. Uh, so we've got our juices on a drip pan. Just gonna baste it so to ensure that they essentially don't dry out. Uh, it's a delicious flavor. So that's what we're doing now. It's gonna be great. Yep, yep, Ooh. yep, yep, yep. Delicious, delicious. Right, now it's time to make our loaded potatoes. To get things started, you're going to be making some meat croutons. So we've got this parsimma. Um, you can see how beautiful it is. It's basically a Turkish pancetta. We'll be cooking this on a very low heat until it's brown. Then basically uh, putting our vegetables in. Right, what we're doing now, ooh, hot potato, is we are actually scooping out the insides of the potato so we, we can mix it in with all these vegetables. But these are fucking hot. So be careful if you're making this yourself. Because you're probably going to burn your hands. Ah! Maybe you should wear a glove, bro. Maybe I should. Don't throw the skins out, because we are going to be putting them back in to these skins. And we put in only a little bit of butter, just a couple of little knobs, just a little bit. Um, and we've got some beautiful Turkish cheddar cheese as well that we are going to be grating into this mixture here. Speed greatness. Whoa! So it just starts to come together. So the mixture that we prepared before, uh, just cook through. Probably not all the way through because we are going to put these back in the oven. Whilst we're doing that, there's some spring onions that are prepared. Chop them in. Roughly chop our chives. And the start of the show, we're going to go with a big dollop of sour cream. Ooh, in. Oh yeah, that's looking good. Looking good. Open it up, nice big dollop, right in there, oh so hot, there it's hot, hot hot hot, put that in there, bring it together, one more final touch, this is a duke's touch, we're going to grate a little bit more cheddar over these babies, some pepper, Back in the oven for about 25 minutes. Woo! Uh, what we're doing now is we're just gonna give them a really nice sear. So they need a really high heat uh, sear. So it's just gonna create like a crust over the uh, meat. It's gonna lock in all those flavors. So it'll be cooking for about two hours at the moment. The two hours in direct heat. Um, now it's just time for that final sear. Once it's seared, we'll also let it rest for about 30 minutes. Looking all those juices. Oh, so delicious. Now it's moment of truth. Uh, we're going to see how the tomahawks came out. So when you're cutting these, the best option is you just cut it from the bone. We're just going to cut like that. You cut. So you get close to the bone as possible. Now this is how it is inside. It's a really nice colour. It's cool. We're aiming for medium rare. And I think that's what we got. Now let's just cut these a little bit more. Oh, they look good. Oh, look at that colour, guys. That is beautiful. Look at it. Ah, oh, exactly how I wanted. That's a nice, medium, rare. Beautiful. 
Beautiful. Oh, it's going to be delicious. There you have it, people. Another successful cook-up today. We've got some beautiful loaded potatoes that's filled with some capsicum, mushrooms, uh, some pasta, which is a Turkish pinchetta, as we talked about. Nailed it. What did you do, Matt? Okay, so we've got some delicious tomahawk steaks that we did cooked over indirect heat. Um, we had a really nice rub on it. They turned out delicious. Um, if you have a look at this, delicious colour. Really nice. Really, really nice. Cheers, bro. Cheers, mate. Mmm. Hey guys, that's another adventure done. See you guys next week. Woo! Nailed it. Ba ba ba.